surf dancer. Less tied to, one might try as a guess, a day of precisely choreographed stress in the ring of the Spanish riding school, still lingering in every perfectly placed and finely turned limb. High stepping, she runs to the surf transformed, as vivid as our morning bed, a tether slipping thoroughbred, a copper mane scooped loose by the wind as a firestorm of rain. Her beauty is melding now with that of the ocean, as liquid as love has formed her to be, as fine, familiar and fluent as the honey-coloured crests, the tumbling torrents of caress, of unbound and surf-seeking, sensual memory. Pearl diving. The woman is sleeping now as a girl could. Curled like a leaf in the autumnal wood, her breathing as deep as the rhythms that sweep and gently beat on the stone's throw beach. The sea in its slumber within easy dreams reach. Olives and Rioja set to one side, smiling sated with a full filled sigh. She settles position in our love-strewn bed. My lamplight shadows the delicate thread in the skein of her weaving of the seen and the said. Off Japan, the armour are diving for pearls, lung-bursting plunges to grace the neck of this girl. In the rubble of sea day where fishers once filed, we brush Roman dust from dolphin tiles as a little owl haunts. Sea Day's marble piles. There is snow on the atlas. The passes are closed. Our grand taxi snaking on the Marrakesh road, past her head high drifts and wind whipped ridges. Gem sellers and jennibers at the red melt sedges. Ice blue bark and sculpt the parapets of bridges. She stands on a rock in the spume heaving bay. Up to her thighs in the surf's pounding play, she phones on her mobile so I can hear her pleasure and shock, sensations as clear as the pearl gleam in our bed at the turn of the year. <laughs>